the Mitsubishi Outlander is an oft-forgotten 5 or 7 seat SUV that rivals cars like the Skoda Kodiak and Nissan X-Trail. Now in its third generation, the Outlander has become more popular in recent years thanks to a tax-beating plug-in hybrid version. The Outlander range was heavily facelifted for 2015, with new styling, extra kit and a revised chassis. In 2017 there was another round of improvements, although these were much more minor. Unfortunately, the fast-moving SUV sector now means there's a number of rivals that are better to drive and nicer to sit in. However, the plug-in hybrid PHEV version remains a pretty unique prospect. While it only makes financial sense for private buyers in certain situations, business users can reap the rewards of low tax and town commuters benefit from cheap and green electric running. If you want a mid-size plug-in hybrid SUV slash crossover, here it is. The Mitsubishi Outlander PHEV stands alone in its segment as the medium-size SUV for Echo Warriors. You can get other hybrid SUVs like the Volvo XC60 T8 twin-engine and the Audi Q7 e-tron, but you'll need a much fatter wallet as well as a bigger garage. If you want an SUV slash crossover but aren't too worried about the Echo bit, the lower end of the Outlander PHEV price range puts it up against high-spec versions of traditionally powered models like the Honda CR-V, Nissan X-Trail, Skoda Kodiak, or VW Tiguan. The Land Rover Discovery Sport, Audi Q5, and Lexus NX might be of interest too. If you want a plug-in hybrid but aren't bothered about the SUV bit, you're looking at options like the Volvo V60 twin-engine, BMW 330e, Mercedes C-Class Estate C350e PHEV or perhaps the VW Passat GTE or Toyota Prius. Mitsubishi first offered the Outlander PHEV for sale in 2013, when there were no other plug-in hybrid SUVs available at all. PHEV is short for Plug-in Hybrid Electric Vehicle, which is an unimaginative and ugly moniker, but it aptly describes the Outlander's modus operandi. The model is supplied with a 2.0-liter four-cylinder petrol engine, a pair of 60 kW electric motors and a 1.2 kWh lithium-ion battery pack which, if fully charged overnight, can take you up to 33 miles without needing to fire up the petrol unit. Charging the battery is achieved by plugging in the car via a flap on the rear three quarters. Aside from its electric powertrain tech, the Outlander PHEV is very similar to the regular Outlander models, and so benefits from the same recent styling updates with new look grille and lights. There's also new cabin tech in the guise of Apple CarPlay and Android Auto smartphone links, while efficiency tweaks mean the Outlander PHEV MPG figure is bumped up to an impressive, claimed, 166 MPG potential.